What is up guys, welcome back to another episode of Return to Freddy Gold Stars. Today we are playing GCN Rainbow Road. The staff ghost is by Fast Selena, also known as Emil P with a 342.139. Only around, the, not even, like, that's, what is that? Not even six seconds behind the BKT, which is also by Emil himself. Um, I am going to be using the spear for this one. Um, it's going to be quite difficult because obviously those those two really sharp 180 turns are going to be very difficult to do with spear because I'm going to have to use the zipper and I can lose a lot of time if I do those incorrectly. Um, and of course the staff goes does do the ending shortcut 3-for-3 three three with the card so I'm going to have to do it 3-for-3 three three, which is also one of the main reasons why I want to use spear because it still gives a challenge because some of the turns are going to be much harder but it gives me an easier time with the shortcut and so I won't have to just keep restarting at the shortcut which would be really annoying so... Obviously, since this is a really long track, I don't want to just keep restarting at the same spot. That would get kind of boring. So I'm just using Spear to make things a little bit more exciting. Of course, as always, we're going to watch a lap of the BKT. 336.455. Watch the replay. Okay. Okay, now obviously we're not going to be doing the same strats as Emil here in the BKT because we're using a completely different vehicle. But it looks like right away he goes to the right side and gets a drift trick to decrease his airtime. Hops to the right, gets a mini triple here. And with Spear, I'm gonna have to hit the edge of those zippers. And Flame Runner, of course, Emil can just take his turns really tight. He tricks off this. This is a very long course. I kind of wish this, this track was two laps, even though it wouldn't be the same as in the GCN version. Just a low trick there by hopping. One, two, three, four, five. He just skips that one, gets a mini turbo, and gets the last two. This alignment is going to be really crucial for me. It's going to be really key to get this alignment right. Because I can gain so much time with Spear. But if I have to keep realigning, then it's not going to be... I'm not going to uh, gain near as much time as I should. Or as much as I need to, in order to beat the, the, the card staff goes. Because the card staff goes, it's actually still pretty difficult. And after the can, the can is trickable now and just gets realigns, gets all the boost panels. And here's the shortcut. Six to the very right side. Right before the boost from the boost panel ends, he uses his room in midair and finishes the lap. Alright, let's give it our best shot. Alright, here we go. I am uh, very bad at this vehicle, so I apologize um, if you see some pretty poor gameplay at the start here. So I'm going to have to get used to the spear, and I'm going to have to get used to driving this track with the spear. Um, this was this is honestly one of my weaker tracks to begin with, just even with Flame Runner. See if I can do this right, just gotta flip that, cancel the wheelie, and then turn. Yeah, Spear's Drift is very weak, I lost a lot of time there. But if I make that, if I can do that faster, like, I'm not too far behind already. Um, that wasn't that bad. But I, I, I can still do that, do that better, and be like, with him. Because if you do the zipper section properly, this is not right, this is not right. <laughs> that was bad, that was so bad, man, oh my god. But yeah, if you do the zipper section like really well, then you can actually like not lose that much time. I fell off. See, that alignment's weird because it's kind of blind. You can't see where the entire straight is because the road is like sloped upwards, so you can't see it. And it's so long and it's so precise, the alignment, in order to take it without realigning. Yeah, this is definitely just not, not one of my favorite tracks at all. Um, the, the update's not bad. Like, I, I don't like, the update did improve from the old version. But the, the track in general, just the overall design of it and the length is just unappealing to me. Yeah, as you can see, I didn't like, lose that much time there. I don't know why my controller just used a shroom though. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just replug this. I didn't even press the button, it just used the shroom. But yeah, I think you see the zipper section, like, that's good track design, like from the update. Um, this update brought those zippers. And the zippers actually like function to the point where you don't even lose much time taking them. Because usually zippers on the outside of turns. If you take them, you lose so much time. It's like they're not even worth going for. But for Spear here, like it's actually kind of... See, it's not that much slower. Taking these zippers. Look at that. I'm like right behind him. And then catch me here, because obviously I'm wheeling. Look at that. Good. Now I just gotta make sure to not miss these boost panels. I'm not a fan of the spell with the boost panels at all. Just do that. Yeah, I missed the boost panels again, man. I need to like learn how to do that. <laughs> it's hard. It's actually really hard to do that boost panel section without without um, with talking while talking. I find it very difficult to do that. Yeah, see, look how much I'm realigning. Like I'm not even getting any time. See, he's just snaking. 
Wow, that was wide. This thing's drift is awful. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm really gonna have to improve that. The, that wish zone section again was horrible, and I need to really make sure to get a good alignment on that straight because realigning that much is just, isn't even faster. But yeah, this is actually like, honestly, with Spear especially, this is not gonna be easy for me. But you know, I always like to challenge myself. I don't want to spend too long on this track though because it is like almost four minutes long, and that like failing lap three or something is just gonna be really, really annoying. Oh my gosh, it's gonna realign like that. That was pretty bad. I think this track should start tight. Okay, start tight, and then you can get that. Just go tight, get that. Okay, so wheelie, make sure you don't die. Not bad. Okay, can we get this proper for one? It's just hard with spear, because I'm not used to the drift. How do you get all these two spin with this one, this one, this one, that one, this one. Don't think I'm supposed to get that one, but that's fine. Got all the boost panels this time. Is that a good alignment? It's not bad. Rewind a little bit. Okay, gained a lot of time on that, straight. Okay, we're not too far behind right now. I'm not sure if I'm gonna gain time on the shortcut or if um, the staff goes is. I'm really curious to see who's gonna have a better time on the shortcut, the cart or the bike. I can make it. There we go, see Spear. Makes the shortcut much easier, but now the drifts, okay, we're not too far behind. 0.3, it's not bad. Well, we're still on the track, nice. Okay. There we go. go tight, and then hit this. And then hit this. Oh my gosh, I didn't get the full zipper. Yeah, this is actually gonna be pretty, pretty difficult, honestly. I know I'm only like five minutes in, but yeah, this it, just driving one lap on this track with Spear is just honestly really, really tasking. Just driving one lap. But yeah, the shortcut is much easier. The, the turn following it is kind of hard, but the shortcut with Spear is just pretty much free. As long as you just shoot at the right time. That's good. And there we go. There we go. That was really good. Good landing as well. We're actually winning right now. Very solid. Okay. Oh my gosh. All right. See how much time we can actually gain on this trade. <laughs> like, look, look, the stack was actually keeping up with me, and he's snaking, and I'm wheeling. It's crazy. Oh my gosh, why can't you just go over that? I saw this, the BKT, like, I mean, he just went over the freaking gap. <laughs> I can't do that. Why is it, why can't I do that? Is it only for that one specific gap? Stupid. I hate how it's windy. I honestly wish it was just one long straight. Oh my gosh, that worked. Am I alive? I am. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was decent. Okay. Really focus and get all these. There we go. And, okay, this is my best pace so far. Not bad. So you can do this section here, nice and fast. Like, just all boost panels, like, even here. Just so many boost panels. Not bad, I'm getting a lot of time right here. Oh my gosh! I lose, I lose a lot of time on that last turn, yeah. Oh my gosh, wow! Okay, with Spear, I need to like have the proper alignment at, at the first shortcut as well. Like, I can't just make it. Like, there I made it, but I was too far to the right, and then I just couldn't take that turn well at all. Yeah, I could have been much better if I didn't hit the wall there. <sighs> I 
why did you have to make the staff class is actually gonna be so easy. It was gonna be easy, and then they made a, and then they made a new staff ghost. And they all made a new staff ghost, which does the shortcut three for three, and has just overall much better lines. And it's just like, man, why? So I don't want to spend time TTing this track. It's just not fun. Why does that happen? Oh my gosh, that's so frustrating. I'm just trying to get a drift trick, man. That's solid. Good alignment as well. Here we go, here we go. Breaking away. Just a little bit. Nice, okay. Alright, attempts. Well, not attempts, but take two with the shortcut. We make this. There we go. Nice. And a good turn. Oh my gosh, yes. Let's go. Come on. I need this. I don't want to play this track anymore. This run just came out of nowhere. Okay, I need to make this a procession. I'm not saying yet, we still have a whole lap of this. Why? What was that? <laughs> what was that, man? Oh my god. Yep, I have to choke out three. It's not it's not it's not me without choking out three, man. What was that? I just, I literally did a, I literally had a good alignment into that zipper and I just rammed into the wall instead. <sighs> now I have to do this again. So another three minutes of my life wasted, if not more, because I'm going to have to do a, spend multiple tries on this now to get back to where it was. Gosh, man, these zippers are just, like, why can't I just do this? This is, okay, that was bad, but, like, that's still fine, like, only it was consistent. I'm alive, but we're good. Just so annoying. No trick. It's okay. that dude not a good start at all not a good start but it's doable don't have to be winning after this cannon don't have to be Okay, we that was a really really good shortcut end turn. So we saved a lot there with that. Okay, here we go. Step section. Up two. That's good. Okay, just gotta make that one more time if we get to lap three. No trick. It's alright. That was very interesting, but it actually worked in an amazing alignment. Wow. Amazing. Let's go. And it's going to be a good turn as well. Nice. Okay, here we go. Okay. 
Oh, that bad landing. Nice. Oh, why? I can never get a drift trick off that. It's close, man. This needs to be good. That was good. I don't know, man. I need to just drive really fast now. Catch him. Go, go, go. What? <sighs> I hate this so much, man. How did I fall off there? Are you kidding me? Oh my God, man. This track is so bad. It's so bad. I don't dislike many custom tracks, you know, being a custom track made and all. Cause like if you're a CT main, you can't just like have a track in the pack. That, that's not being a CT main, you know? But like, come on, man. This track is just not it. Just not it. Okay, that was amazing. Yeah. Maybe if I TC with was Flame Hunter, it'd be a lot easier. It would, definitely. But. Very, very good start, actually. Okay, it's a fall off here again. Nice. Oh wow, this is definitely my, my best start. Wow. 100%. If we can make the sugar here, then we'll be in business. Nice. Not the best turn, but it's fine. No, it's not fine. What was that? Barely ahead after this. I think that was a wide turn. Still behind, actually. Fine though. What was that? You're hundred percent making that. Yep. That's fine. Please just live. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Nice. There we go. Okay, made it work. Okay, we're almost there, kind of. More than halfway done. <laughs> yeah. 
Nice turn. Okay, didn't die to the ramp. Okay, please just make the zipper section. Here we go. Oh, that was beautiful. We're gaming, dude. Very nice. Where is he? Okay, he's right there, actually. With one thing standing in our way, between grinding this out for another god who knows how long, and oh my gosh, no! Good. Please win. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh, we did it. Thank you. I've never, honestly, even though this only took like an hour. This was worse than RBC. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I would never had this little fun time trying before. Wow, that was just such a pain. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad that was done. My hands are hurting, they're sweating. It's just so much, a, such a long track. Just so long. You have to focus for such a long time. And the zipper section is just awful. The boost panel spiral was awful. The straight is okay, but and of course the shortcut is just, at times, it's not that hard, but failing it just really, really is just really hard, annoying because then you have to do, drive the entire lap again. Thankfully, I never failed at lap three. I made it at lap three, and we just barely got on top. Change course, we'll see the difference. All right, so we got a 341.912, and the staff ghost is a 342.139. That's 0.2, just over 0.2. Barely, I'll take it. With Spear on DC and Rainbow Road, I will take that. 100%. We only have one more Staff Ghost left from this update, and of course, it's going to be SNES BC2. It's going to be quite the challenge, but I'm really excited to play that because it's going to be more fun than this for sure. But that is all for this episode of Return to 50 Gold Stars. As always, if you enjoyed, be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time.